In this video, I'll be helping you with the math problem type called Simplifying Algebraic Expressions, as seen here in the OpenStax College Algebra 2nd Edition text. We're asked to simplify each of these algebraic expressions. Starting with A here, we can see that of the five terms listed, some of those are like terms, meaning that they have the same variables raised to the same powers. So for example, 3x and our 1x here, those can be added. So combining would give us a 4x. And then also the y terms, we have a minus 2y and a minus 3y. Those can be added as a minus 5y. And then since the minus 7 doesn't have any like terms to be combined with, we want to make sure that we just bring that down. So this would be our simplified version for expression A. Moving on to expression B, before we can add or combine any like terms, we need to remove any parentheses. And here the parentheses is being used to show that the negative 5 is being multiplied by everything inside the parentheses. So we will need to distribute that negative 5 to both terms. I'll start by just bringing down the 2r and then multiplying negative 5 times 3, a minus 15. Negative 5 times a negative r would be a positive 5r. And then again, bringing down the plus 4. In our first step, we've removed the parentheses. Now I can look for like terms to add. And the 2r and the plus 5r are like terms. Those can be added to be 7r. The minus 5 and plus 4 are also like terms. Those can be combined as a minus 11. So this is our simplified b expression. For expression C, we also have parentheses that we will want to evaluate so that we can drop those parentheses. And here the first parentheses is grouping the 4t minus 5 fourth s together, but there's no operation here to be done. So I can drop the first parentheses. For the second parentheses, we do have this minus outside. So it's as if there is a negative 1 that's being multiplied by everything inside the parentheses. We will want to distribute that negative 1 to remove the parentheses. Multiplying negative 1 by 2 thirds t would be a minus 2 thirds t. And then the minus 1 times the plus 2s would be a minus 2s. Now that we have the parentheses removed, we can look for like terms to combine. And our 4t and minus 2 thirds t are like terms because they only have the variable t and a coefficient. To combine these though, I will need to get a common denominator. And since the only denominator is 3, I can rewrite the 4t as 12t over 3. And then combining like terms, the 12 thirds minus 2 thirds would give us a 10 thirds t. Then for the s terms, they also need a common denominator. So here I'll rewrite the minus 2s as a minus 8s over 4 to get a common denominator. Now I can combine negative 5 fourths minus 8 fourths would be a negative 13 fourths s. So c has been fully simplified. For d, there are no parentheses. So we can go straight to combining like terms. 2mn plus 3mn would be 5mn. Minus 5m does not have a like term to combine it with, so I will bring that down. And the same is true for the plus n. There are no like terms to combine, so I'll bring that down as well. This is our simplified d expression. 